Our work as designers, we like to be connected to bigger ideas. The butterfly effect is famously connected to chaos theory and the notion that a little thing, like a butterfly flapping its wings in China, can yield a big thing like a hurricane in, off the coast of Africa. Well, the butterfly effect theory itself talks about how very small actions can mean big changes. So that's very inspiring when you think about what we do, that just little small actions can have very big positive effects. Well, from a design perspective, what we realize is the Italian stone cutters say, God never had a bad day by design. And if you stop and look at butterflies at every scale, from the scale of the full butterfly all the way down into the very fine grain of its transparent wings that are just uh, illuminators and prisms, we realize that at every scale they're very beautiful. The collaboration with William McDonough begins looking at the scales of the butterfly. And if you look at the individual scales of the butterfly, you can create individual patterns that have this unique visual. I'm Pamela Rainey and I'm creative director for PatCraft. Well, collaboration is really fun. Um, and the fun part about that is working together with Bill, he brings us a design concept. And then also, he forces us to think differently. So in that, we get a really much greater end result by working together. And that for designers, when they visualize a space, if they could take the butterfly wing, for example, and then render it as a pixelation and a fractal, and then layer it into a space from the simplest monochrome to the most complex and ornate colorful um, patterns. It gives the designer a full range of opportunity from the very simple to the highly uh, complex. So one of the things he has challenged us to look at differently is the way we design these floor patterns. Instead of limiting them to one room confined by walls or an area that's confined by walls, He's challenged us to look at the entire space and let's treat it as a whole and use the butterfly wing as the inspiration for the flooring layout. And with that, when we use nature as the inspiration, we're able to make these great subtle color transitions that are much easier to do when you use the actual inspiration versus just trying to put it together on your own. The beauty of the butterfly effect is the fact that we have three different patterns of different scales that can interactively uh, work together. So we have three running line styles in the collection and then those are offered in 18 running line colors along with we'll have a solid color coordinating product. And also this product is designed to be beautifully durable. We can offer them a range of opportunity from the simplest to the most complex but if you have a delightfully complex result which could be a butterfly wing um, and you can do everything in between. The designers can quickly visualize various things that they want to do and present them for their own uh, review and for other people who might enjoy it later and come up with things that they find beautiful. And then we have a tool that lets that translate into an effective delivery of that floor. I just think that's a wonderful idea because it takes the opportunity of a two-dimensional image and renders it visible and then renders it deliverable um, all at once. Flooring matters because it is really the foundation of the built environment. My name is John Curran and I'm the Director of Design and Construction at St. Jude. But you also want an environment in a hospital where you don't know you're in a hospital. So you have to make effort into color Usually you're working off of, you either do something really dramatic on the walls or you do something really dramatic on the floor. Probably three quarters of our spaces are carpeted. They're administrative spaces or they're research spaces or they're gathering spaces. So a hospital is, is really, it's not all a clinical environment. There are business occupancies in hospitals. There's a gathering space, greeting spaces in hospitals. The unique thing about this collection, again with our collaboration with William McDonough, is that it also is based on the cradle-to-cradle -cradle principles. 
If you think about cradle-to-cradle -cradle principles, it's based in the uh, extreme evaluation of all the materials that goes in. It's based on energy, water, end of use, and social responsibility. Even as much as 10 years ago, normal products did harm. They were harmful to you when you occupied the space. They were harmful while you were using it. So I think we all started thinking about what are we putting in our house and as designers we need to think about what we're putting in our buildings. We're using Solution Q Extreme with superior performance qualities and good stain resistance. So again it makes it beautifully durable. Solution Q Extreme not only has gone through the cradle to cradle process of evaluation but also because of its performance attributes in the maintenance process really only requires water so you don't have to worry about those harsh chemicals so all the way through the process it can be uh, providing sustainable value. When Packcraft approached us about this project, it was especially exciting for us. The concept of the butterfly effect, where small decisions have large impact, are so much like the way Danny Thomas made a very small decision to honor St. Jude by building a shrine. And that promise fulfilled has truly changed the world, just like the butterfly effect does. We're very excited about the opportunity to work with William McDonough in this collaboration. Also, we are honored to be able to participate with St. Jude. My name is Karen White. I'm the Senior Vice President of Strategic Partnerships for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. Well, there's no place like St. Jude. Since we opened our doors 50 years ago, we've truly changed the way the world understands and treats pediatric cancer. And the work we've done at St. Jude has pushed childhood cancer survival rates from 20% when we opened our doors to more than 80% now, and we're not done. In the next decade, we hope to push survival rates to 90%, and we won't stop then. We won't stop until no child dies from pediatric cancer. And for every square yard that is sold of Butterfly Effect, a portion of those proceeds go to St. Jude. And not only does the, the money go to support children that are facing difficult uh, cancer and difficult diseases, it also goes to their great research labs. So St. Jude Children's Research Hospital is one part children's hospital and one part research center. The discoveries made at St. Jude are shared freely so that doctors across the world can expand on our protocols and our treatments and heal kids worldwide. And just that small action can have big change as they share their research with other hospitals all across the world. So it's a global effect up for children's health care. So at St. Jude, no family ever receives a bill for anything, treatment, travel, housing, or food, so that families with children suffering from childhood cancer or other pediatric illnesses don't have to worry about anything except helping their children live. And we're able to do that with the generous support of our donors and corporate partners like Packcraft, who really make the difference in terms of the way we're able to deliver treatment and care to the kids at St. Jude. It costs $1.9 million a day to operate St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, and 75% of those funds come from the general public through generous corporate donors like Packcraft, as well as individuals. Our average donation is $35, so that's a lot of donations that it takes to support the groundbreaking research and life-saving treatment done at St. Jude each and every day. We're especially excited about this partnership with Packcraft and the Butterfly Effect Collection. It's designed to be beautifully durable, and when I think about our patients at St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, that's exactly what I think about their beauty and the, their strength as they endure, all they endured in their journeys with cancer. So I think it's a great synergy that we have in this partnership with Packcraft and the Butterfly Collection. And we believe while this may be a small action, it can have a major impact with St. Jude and beyond. Children need to see hope in the world and that the world's getting better and that we have more butterflies, not less. And so this idea that we would connect to that hope in this childlike way, in a sophisticated system of delivery and, and endless resourcefulness honors the idea of endless resourcefulness for life, for technology, and especially, you know, food for thought and the resourcefulness of our children and their dreams.